Hi, I'm James and welcome to this Getting Started series. In this video, I'm going to show you the three-year financial forecast for a startup. I'm going to use this to show you how BRICS works and what makes it unique. The rest of the series will then focus on building up a forecast from scratch. I'll keep each video short and to the point so you'll learn something new without having to plow through hours of footage. All right, let's get started. At its core, BRICS is a financial forecasting tool that makes it easy to create detailed financial reports, whether you're looking to start a new business or forecast an existing one. That's not the whole story though. What truly sets BRICS apart is that you can build up a complete visual picture of your business that contains every financial activity in one highly visible place. Your forecast is built up piece by piece from components. Each component represents a real world activity, such as these t-shirts that I'm selling, or the rent that I'm going to be paying for my office, or my personal savings that I'm planning on investing into the launch of my startup. It's all here. They are divided into these four categories. Green represents sources of income, red for various types of costs, yellow for purchasing assets such as the equipment needed to run the business, and blue for the funding a business will need. Every business in the world can be split down into these four types of building blocks, and you can use different combinations of these components to create any business. When you start your own plan, it begins with a structure like this that you can adapt to fit what you're doing. So over on the right, we're looking at the dashboard for my new brand of sports gear, showing its three-year monthly cash flow forecast. You can see the journey this business is going to take over the next few years as it takes its initial investment and launches, gradually growing sales over time and expanding year on year. It's the result of the components of my plan calculated together. You can access the reports here at the top. So the figures you enter into the components send the numbers over to multiple reports, placing them into the correct accounts in your cash flow, profit and loss and balance sheet. It doesn't matter where they are located in your plan or how you choose to group them together. The numbers will always find their way to the right account lines. So the plan on the left allows you to freely group items together by categories important to your business, such as geographic regions, by sales channels, or brands of products, for example. It's a business-focused picture, not clouded by accounting requirements or structures. Your reports are there to do the accounting work, taking this picture and translating it into a set of formalized financial accounts doing all the heavy lifting for you so that you can concentrate on the business itself. You can dive into these accounts to see and compare these groups that you set up and drill all the way down to the component level so you'll always know exactly what each account is made up from even if you don't have a financial background. It means that anyone can look at a BRICS plan and quickly understand what the business does and where it's going. Okay, so we've been looking at a complete plan with all the income, costs, assets, and funding associated with it. The dashboard is busy visualizing three years of cash in and out, and there's a whole set of detailed reports for every part of the business. There's quite a lot going on. You might think it took a long time to set this up. Spoilers, it didn't, and I'm going to show you how to do it step by step. The next few videos will go through these fundamental building blocks, income, expenditure, assets and funding, starting with how to forecast your sales with the income component. Once you've been through these videos, you'll have a thorough understanding of all the elements that go into a financial forecast and how simple it is to get there in BRICS. I hope you enjoy planning your business in BRICS. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.